Hey everyone, not the Mother Sister 4 here, and today we're going to continue on some more of the Puyo Puyo Tetris EX era. Well, pretty much by continuing, I mean finishing because this is actually the last bit of it. Anyway, we're here to show squares. This transformation. So, yeah, basically on this last level here on EX4, it's. Marvel was acting a little bit sus with the fact that the two worlds were merged at some point, but now we're gonna see if we can make it right. And no, what you're seeing here is not a glitch, it's squares versus squares in this part. Right choice. Your obsession with these worlds needs to stop. They've stolen all your attention and put order at risk. That's why I'm going straight to them myself. What? No! You can't do that! You know better than that! My duty is to place what's right above all else. And I believe more than anything that this is the right thing to do. You do? But why? I'm not done. As for the two worlds, you and I will merge them once again. We'll locate these flawed bonds, these conflicts, and we'll erase them from existence. Excuse me? I don't think I heard you correctly, Squares, but did you just say... You heard me just fine. All you have to do is gather power for me. I'll do the actual erasing. And I'm sure it'll be lots of fun. No! I don't want that! I see. And how about this? Why don't I hold on to your mind for a little while? No! Stop! Stop! Huh? Who are you? I'm Squares. I'm the person you become after a lot of people go out of their way to help you. What are you talking about? Oh, how ignorant and naive I was. Fool! Answer me! I could insist for you to stop all this right here and now. The only way I was able to grow was by making mistakes. It makes it quite difficult to decide what to do with you. Does that make sense, past me? I don't know what you're rambling on about. Just get out of my way! Don't make me make you. Oh? I'd like to see you try it. Yeah. So, we're playing the reformed squares that happened during the story, and we're kind of just interacting with squares in the past. I don't know when exactly this has happened, this is just basically what's happening now. Anyway, time swap for a minute and 20 seconds. I think that's really only about like, two to three rotations before you have to restart it. Oh my goodness, I thought, and honestly, it's kind of sad, man. Because like... The dude clearly does not want to do all this. But he's like, no, this has to be the right way to do things. There is no other way to look at this. Oh, frick. God, I, I really need to hurry up. I don't have much time left. How's that? Tetrahedron! How's that? Harmonic box! Adamantine kill! No! Impossible! Okay, it's over. It's over. Impossible! Woo! This is the right outcome. Okay. Onwards with this. Self-reformation? I- I don't know what to call it at this point. He's gone. It was just another vision. A memory of my past regrets. <sighs> so that's what happened! That was a vision of your past, wasn't it? Who's there? You just couldn't let go of Marl, could you? Now, look at you. You have nowhere to go. Answer me! 
I won't ever make the same mistake again. You hear me? Squares. It's you. Come this way. Hurry. Huh? Yeah. So all that was just a mere image of what happened in the past. Now we're pretty much just going through what happened during the sec the segment between when Squares when Squares reappeared with the gang, like the main gang with All Amity and Ringo. And what happens when they actually beat him the last time. That's basically what this EX is. I kind of wish you had access to this before the final section, but it's what it is. Right choice. I think we're in the clear. What's going on? Let go of me! Sorry, but there was no time to explain. And I couldn't just leave you there. Well, can you explain now? That voice from earlier belonged to the Wanderer of Worlds. There's still a great deal I don't understand about him. Now listen, and listen well. If the Wanderer deems you to be powerful, he haunts you, so to speak. He then uses your dark past as a weapon to torment you, and he won't stop. How? By honing in on any dark deeds you've committed. He uses them against you. Don't you see how serious this is? Not really. Squares, you're going to keep getting these visions. They won't stop until you free yourself from the Wanderer's grasp. Dark deeds of my past. This happened to me before, too. Except in your case, you became obsessed with Marl. You two went through a lot together, and it eventually tore you apart. Hey! Who are you to say that? If that's how you react to hearing the truth, then I feel sorry for you. The Wanderer of Worlds will play you like a fiddle. Shut up! Perhaps a battle will teach you how to close that enormous mouth of yours. I don't think we have the time. I said shut up! Now, come on! Yeah, for some reason, this particular level has its text placements a little bit all over the place. But anyway, regardless, Tetris, Tetris. I thought it was going to be Puyo Tetris, but it's Tetris Tetris on 135. And it's freaking X no less. This dude is mad powerful. In OG anyway. Here he's just pretty much like I mentioned earlier on other occasions where it's like all these previously really tough bosses are just kind of here now. Ooh, you know what? Screw your retribution. Goodbye. Oh yeah, I was wait <laughs> I don't know why I got caught. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> like 130 is that way. But yeah. Like pretty much this is just normal for what 
I believe Akala was what he was referring to with the whole Wanderer, because he is the Wanderer of Dimension. Or at least I, I think that's how it goes. So Wanderer of Dimension? Ah, I can't put it there. What? I really gotta pick up the pace and start doing better, like, doing better at general building. the longest one now and I'm not even on the third level I think I beat you now leave we're on the same side in case you've forgotten <laughs> Found you. well this isn't good hey there stairs it's squares come on don't be like that Let's be friends! I'm a fellow boss level character who's made plenty of mistakes of his own. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. Who is this guy? Well, don't say I didn't warn you. Now, I'm going to teach you how to fend off the final boss. I have no clue what this guy's talking about. Yeah, you're not the first. First, trying to make everything right is just way, way too complicated. So let's knock that off, shall we? I'm going to punch him. P patience You're supposed to keep things in order, remember? Now let's try to stay calm. Personally, I think you could have handled things with a little more panache. For example, starting a circus, or opening an amusement park. Ooh, maybe even creating another world. What are you even saying? You no longer have it now, but you once possessed a great power. It was something so incredible and almighty. You could have done anything you wanted with it. Echolo! Oops, did I say too much? We both know Squares is still young. It's not right to teach him such outlandish concepts yet. Jeez, you're always so overprotective. Don't go twisting my intentions around. If you really want to stop me, then you have to entertain me instead. I figured it would come to this. 
Yeah. And now we're fighting Echo. As X. 20k points, so let's score base. I can relax my fingers after that last level. Good freaking lord. Well, actually not really, because I still gotta... Hold it down, quite literally. Ah, uh, wait, 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 wait. I think I have something, this, this time for real. What if I put it, uh, I can't get over, oh my god. Oh, that plan's ruined. I have no idea what I was trying to do with, with that there. Slide on there. Oh, it didn't count because we didn't do it in the swap. Fresh. That should... Oh, frick, we need 20k points. We have to keep playing. <laughs> oh, frick. Either keep playing or we just get a really high enough score and do change and all that. Oh my god. Actually, why didn't I put that there? Yeah, I think I wanna... Hmm. Okay. Cover this. Oh, if only I had the OP frick. So yeah, in situations like this where you need a higher score, like I've mentioned, I think I've mentioned this before, but you basically have to focus on playing longer or playing with higher, like harder damage than it is normally just by trying to do it quickly, which is the real twister of it all. Uh, wait. Oh, wait, no, I need the right piece for that. Oh, frick. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, good lord. Oh my god, what is this assortment? Ah! Oh, it's all, it's all gone now. Whatever idea I had is pretty much all gone at this point. Just say, just to get it out of here. Nope, 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 I only have 15. And on top of that, only 15k points. Oh my god. <laughs> Of course, it's the extra ones where all the struggling and efforts needed to be made here is where it actually all goes down. Awesome. When the game is pretty much done and said. Frick. Okay, uh... I have another idea. And this time it's actually practical. I think. Ah, frick. Well, it's not practical now. Okay. Awesome. Miss me with that. Frick, I don't want to end this, and it's like, you need a good, like, really strong chain for this, if you want to end it quickly anyway. Awesome. 
Might need to go through a whole labyrinth of ideas for that sucker over there. Though. I think I feel like I'm starting to understand where the issue that my building is. Because right now I can definitely see it's from not paying too much attention to the next game. Which, if I haven't mentioned this already, is basically how you can tell which piece awesome. is coming up next. That's self-explained by the name. Oh. No! Oh god, no! 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 Because, like, if I don't stall it and I hits like that, even though the timer would have went down, like, the second it touches the X, the timer stops. So, the game's pretty much over at that point. Awesome. Probably shouldn't have wasted that. Okay. Okay, green. Purple's way too high. They all, awesome. give it all, uh... I wanted to make something off of like a perfect like this, an all clear. I don't know why I keep calling it perfect, but an all clear like this. Oh my goodness! Awesome. There's so much. There's so much to play. I definitely gotta learn, relearn, cause like it's cra It's just crazy. Well, actually, Puyo and Tetris, and you know what's the best part about this game? That is literally the best thing for about this, because like they have trials and everything, which I know I haven't really disclosed in this playthrough, and I probably won't be able to. But yeah, like this game actually has trials for you to like figure stuff out when it comes to making change and everything, which is absolutely nice for people who aren't really like feeling too confident on like their chain capabilities and frick. Okay, okay. I just think all we want to do here. Because if I was fighting a real opponent, I wouldn't have the time to think. That's why you need to actually learn the chains. Awesome. Wait. Ah, it doesn't work. Because like, I needed the lot. I needed this right here. God dang it. Alright. Let's see. Ooh, purple. Yes, 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 yes. Purple. Yellow's over here. Yellow and blue. Alright, this might be the big go home for the fit for the whole like video. Let's do this. Let's go! He's finished. And I actually got well over 220k. He's done. Let's go! Thank you. That was fun. I did not even count how many. You know what? I'm a I'm gonna overwrite one of them. I'm gonna look back at that one. <laughs> Listen, Ecolo. I know this is all just fun and games to you, but don't pull anything reckless around squares. Understand? Would you say something like that? The only reason we came here was to help unravel this kid's tangled heart. What do you mean, we? Isn't that right, Dark Prince? Why must you go and spoil the surprise? Wait, you too? What's going on? Honestly, Squares? I haven't a clue, but yeah, this is the last level we're going to be playing, and the last part. So, I want to say that after this, we're going to look back at that replay, 
to see what happened at EX7 because I really want to... I think I'm going to take this time to just look at replays after this, so this is probably going to be a really long video, and I do apologize in advance. Right choice. Looks like I've been missing out on all the fun. Eh, not really. This place is pretty lousy, I gotta say. <sighs> you there. Squares, was it? What's it to you? It seems you're feeling quite guilty about what you did. And? Marl and my sweet Arlie showed you kindness. And they forgave you. But you haven't forgiven yourself. That's why you keep having your visions. Is that really why? Oh, without a doubt. Ah, I see now. Look, Squares. It's hard to forgive ourselves for the choices we made when we were different people. Especially when you think back on how badly you wanted those things at the time. But never forget how far you've come. And don't try to bury the past. I don't have to... undo my past? Nobody can undo the past. As long as you live, you'll always have a past. Let me share something with you, Squares. There always comes a time when someone appears who seeks absolute control. And it doesn't matter if they're trying to conquer a village or an entire world. It always comes down to the same reason. The selfish heart of a single person. Are you, of all people, really simple? Ecolo, quiet down for a bit. As I was saying, at the end of the day, everything worked out for the better. Keep walking. Keep growing. Give it some time, and you'll figure out your next moves. I... I understand. Ha! Then let's end this heartfelt moment with a battle! Wow. I'm not gonna front with you guys on that. That was actually a good message. It's too bad we gotta do this under the pressure of having to do this on like... What was it? Two... Like Tetris vs. Puyo in a minute and 30 seconds? We already established and I'm not quite that fast with like Tetris. I messed up the conversion. Oh my god. We've already established that I'm not quite the fastest with Tetris, so... Uh, it feels like I'm fighting my hand. Oh my god! <laughs> I think the worst part about this is the fact that you have to just accept that these are the kinds of mistakes you're going to make. And the thing is, Dark Prince, you probably could have guessed what I'm going to say with this next, but Dark Prince is the final of the characters that are just overwhelmingly powerful. Only difference is this dude is actually just as powerful as he would be in the, in the other games. Like in the other Puyo games, I mean. Uh, he really canceled that. Okay. He cancelled it again! Oh my gosh. Cosmic rectangle! How's that? Tetrahedron! <laughs> you fool! <laughs> you fool! You fool! Cosmic rectangle! Hey! Tetrahedron! How's that? Okay, yes, yes, we're picking up the pace. This is like the, this is what I like to see. Mm, I probably should have put that there. How's that? Harmonic box, tetrahedron. Hey, how's that? Yes, let's go. You fool. 
Are you serious? After all that? And I ran out of time. God dang it. <laughs> that was a really good perfect shoot, too. Uh... Yeah, I'm starting to feel them, them Tetris nerves, bro. So, a little context on that, by the way. We already know that the whole concept of, like, Blue versus Tetris with different rules apply and everything. The craziest thing about Tetris versus Puyo is that you know how when it comes to Tetris or Puyo, when you take damage, it pretty much obstructs your ability to like build anything. Tetris rules does not care for that. If anything, you can, if you're lucky enough, you can actually get the garbage that's sent on your board to help you get like a free Tetris or whatever. And I've seen rare instances where they actually helped you get a perfect clear. And there's absolutely nothing the Puyo I can do about that. Die! Come on! Dang it! I wanted the last Teak Spin, but that's okay. That's okay. We got under a minute. Let's do this. Well, that about does it. I'll be taking my leave now. Ta-ta! Oh, I guess it's bye bye for me too. I'll be back, and I'll only be half as much trouble next time. <laughs> well, it won't be an easy road ahead. If you ever need anything, just say the word. Take care now. Yeah, you too. Hmm, I wonder. They didn't come by just to cheer me up. Did they? <laughs> yeah, right. And like that, in this world, we have freaking four stars. And just like the rest of them, I'm not doing that for this video. So, let's wrap it all up with a showcase of what the game itself has to offer. So, let's go to the replays. God, the last time I played this in... March, or at least the last time it saved, because obviously the place were. Anyway, let's look at this and see what this is all about. I'll discard these afterwards. Now, the cool thing about replays is that you can actually fast forward. I'm not sure about rewinding, but you can slow it down. Let's see, can you slow it down? No, you can't. You can't rewind it, but you can speed it off. So let's see. Was it right here? Cause like this is where I started actually picking up speed and building. All I need to do is also press A to pause. Yeah, this is where I started picking up speed because like, I knew what I wanted to do, but I needed the pieces for it. I probably should have put the rule in there in hindsight. Five, six. Okay, eight, that's actually pretty good. Okay, okay, okay. So now we need to look at that. Let's, uh... Oh, so it just immediately discards everything. Okay, cool. Now, of course you have the player icon where you can change up your profile, the teams for skill battle, the stats of your player records, including achievements, game settings, and the shops where you can purchase everything. Now... If you're like me, and you absolutely just cannot try to get everything like this at once. Well, I can, but I'm not gonna- I'm speaking for everyone else in this case. There is a cheat code for that, where you can just unlock everything, which is also how I managed to know so much about the adventure mode here. But lastly, I don't have to explain multiplayer. We literally just played everything, and it's just more human players. The cool thing about this is that one thing I- don't believe I have went over. There was a specific mode that I haven't went through. Yes, just right here, Tiny Puyo, where it's basically everything we've played with Puyo Puyo, but you have a much larger board or much smaller pieces, however you want to look at it, to play with, and you could see some insane Puyo Tiny Puyo chains if you start mastering it. But that's really about the extent of it. With that, versus you have either playing with a, the CPU since we're in solo, or the endurance run where we play against many. 
of the CPU until we just lose. And this right here is what I was talking about earlier, the lessons where you actually have the trials for Puyo Puyo, Fusion, Tetris, and Fado, or at least I think it's just, no, it's only Puyo Puyo and Tetris. I thought it would be these two as well, unless I have to actually watch these as well, because I haven't yet. Regardless, in Problem, this is where you actually get to do all these trials and they'll ask you, can you do this? Can you do that? Can you do all this, that, and that? The game can give you hints if you wanted to, but it's very clear that the game wants you to go through this without going through hints so you can figure it out. After all, it is a puzzle game. Lastly, for this little tour of the game, we have online. Where we have Puzzle League, where you play with ranks. Free play, that doesn't affect your ranks. Options and data, takes you back to the options and data screens. Join a friends room if any friends of yours is actually playing this. And none of them are. You can't see it on my side. You can't see it, but basically none of them are playing it. Challenge ranking. You have to play through these challenges while playing online to check the rule set. Which we're not going to check because I'm not doing this today. The replays that are uploaded by all the other players. And of course a boss raid where it's basically skill battle, but you're playing against a really strong version of an opponent. I remember the boss raid was actually the only way you can unlock Sonic at some point. Which is actually pretty cool to think about it. The fact that Sonic... No, like actually Sonic the Hedgehog is actually a playable character in this freaking game. Try to keep up. Yes, it's not a mod or anything like that. This is actually in the game. <laughs> okay, okay. But that's it. That is it for Puyo Puyo Tetris 2 in its entirety. Absolutely a fun game, a slight improvement over the original, definitely still has some few spots from the first game that this game didn't really cover, but in terms of the whole like balancing and whatnot, I didn't really, what is it, delve into in the details, there's definitely an effort into this game. The only thing this game I think sorely lacks is the lack of crossplay. If this game had crossplay, this would have been... Probably the biggest Puyo game out there. The biggest. Like, cause like Puyo Puyo Esports or Puyo Puyo Champions actually does not have crossplay either. But the thing is that game is like really big amongst like competitive Puyo players versus Tetris where it's basically whatever is the new Tetris game. There's, Tet there's Tetra.io, Tetris Effect Connected, which I'm hoping to get that at some point cause that's actually really fun. And I think that's it for Tetris, unless Tetris Friends comes back or something like that. But we ain't in that era of revivals anymore. At least I don't think so. So with that being said, this is our tour of the world. Thank you guys for watching. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay insane, stay natural fueled. Stay tuned to Just Already Alive. Stay warped for Tetris. Stay warped for Puyo Puyo Battles. And stay warped! In general, because I honestly don't know what I'm going to do for my next playthrough. I'm thinking maybe something related to Crash, Bomberman, something along those lines. Heck, maybe even do the Suspect Cemetery for Brawl or something. I don't know. Like, there's just a lot of ideas I have now, now that I'm starting to really do this stuff with YouTube again. But I don't know what's just going to be the next one. But whatever or whenever that happens... I'll see you then, but until then, farewell.